Before you know it, school will be out. You'll have the kids loaded up in the van, headed on vacation. But you have to entertain the kids to keep them from fighting if you're like my family. To help us do that, we have a craft project that Elizabeth McGee, Crafty McGee, is going to tell us about. It's a no-so matching game. Good morning to you, Elizabeth. Good morning. And this is a, is a fun game, and you say it's very easy to create. Yes. So um, most of the time when you see these games, they're made out of thick cardboard, mm -hmm. and so they each have pairs. Right. So this is sort of what we're creating here. The fabric is the same on the back, and then the kids would flip it over looking for a match. Gotcha. So and this is a game that can last for hours. That's right. When, when you have kids in the car, and it's, it's fun. It keeps them entertained. Yeah, and this, because it's fabric, you can wash it. Um, it's a no-sew project, so it's good to do with the kids. So right, what show, show you need is this foam. Mm -hmm. And so this foam is sticky on both sides, as you can see. Where do you find something like this? This is, um, I found this at Joanne's Craft okay. Store. And then this is the, um, it's called Foomph this Boom. particular product, mm. but I'm sure you could find other brands as okay. well. So you would peel off one side and stick a piece of fabric on there. Mm -hmm. And this is going to be the same on all sides. Right. So this is like the back of it. Gotcha. And then you want to cut out the 12 squares, mm -hmm. which I've shown you here. And then you want to match fabrics. Yes. So we've already done this little dog here and you're going to stick the, peel the other side and stick it on this fabric. All right. And press it down. So we have a dog on one side and bones yes. on the fabric on our so other side. So the bones are going to be on all the backs of these. Gotcha. All right. We're good. <clears throat> now you were telling me you want them to be the same size. Yes. So you can hold, you can trim the edges off one of them mm -hmm. and then hold it up to the other cards and yeah. trim it to that so they're the same size. All right. Very easy. Where do you find fabric like this? Um, you, these are called fat quarters, mm -hmm. um, and so they just come in little bundle packs of matching fabrics. You can get these at any craft store, or you can cut um, like a yard of fabric from the bolt. All right, talk to me about cost. How much are we talking here? So you can get a fat quarter for a dollar, and then Not bad. this foam is about four dollars. So it's about five dollars to make 12 cards. And it'll keep the kids entertained. Now, you also have uh, an event coming up that uh, you would like to share with us. When yes. is that? So the first week of June, we always have our craft meetups for DIY Louisville um, the first Wednesday of the month. So um, we're going to be meeting um, at Center Goss Coffee. Just bring your own craft and hang out. Awesome. If you would like more information on this NOSO project to keep the kids entertained, just log on to our website, WDRB.com. That's where you can find more information on Crafty McGee's blog as well. Thank you very much. Thank I always you. have a good time and learn something when you come on the show. Great.